Soka Say So Live and direct my Uber Soka Cruise 2016 with QOB herself, Destra Garcia. Hello. <laughs> Welcome aboard. We Thank are you. overjoyed Thank to you. have you here Thank you. as a headliner. How does it feel to be here? Well, first of all, this is my first actual boat cruise. I have not been on one for a lot of different reasons. I've watched Titanic. I've watched Poseidon Adventure. <laughs> But then, even being on the boat, I think I'm more of a land and air person than an ocean person. I feel every move on this boat. But, you know, I'm good. I'll be fine. So you're performing tonight? Tonight. Um, mm -hmm. do, are you going to do anything extra special for um, the people on the you know, You know, it's always very spontaneous, my performances. Um, I kind of go with the audience and what happens in the moment. Apart from the songs, which are obvious, I may sing this, that, the other things that they like. Um, I really can't say. I don't know what to expect. I hope it's not outside because last night I heard the wind was in everybody's hair and yeah, this, throwing everything down. This hair was over here. Next so. thing it blows me away. <laughs> no, but, but I don't know. I don't know. Tonight is just going to be energy and vibes as always. That I could promise you. Great. Talking about expectations. Can we expect to see Lucy in 2017? Well, Lucy is always there, you know. I just have to keep her dormant sometimes because she tries to take over the brand. You know, she has to understand that it's Destra first and then QOB, right? And then Lucy, she's the last one in, but she likes to take over. But Lucy, if you're looking, while you're watching this, know that I'm in charge, okay? <laughs> Well, we at Soka Say So, we are followed by all the Soka lovers all the world who have been following you for years mm -hmm. and years, from the no shoes on stage, Zetra, oh, wow. to, to, uh, to Lucy, all back and forth. Tell us a little bit about the evolution of Destra. Well, you know, as time goes by, you change based on what is in the atmosphere. You change based on the type of soca music that is out there, the type of artists that are out there. You know, when I came out, I was kind of looking at people like um, Rennie McIntosh and Marshall was always there. Alison Hines, Saucy Wow, Iwa George. These were some of the people making a lot of noise then. And, you know, you look at them and you say, okay, I want to marshal the place just like them. I want to do this like them and whatever. But at the same time, you still want to be yourself. So you do evolve from being you know, a perception of what you think yourself is, and then as you grow, you become something else. So for me, I'm still that same person you talked about, the same take it off your shoes, Dasha, but I guess the element has to happen for that to happen. Mm -hmm. You know, so all these different me's that people see, it's still me. It just depends on where I am and how, how the crowd seems and what vibe and energy I'm in, you know. But the evolution has been great. Soca music is awesome and we continue to try to take soca to all the parameters of the earth, you know, and it's working. I'm seeing a lot of different people in different places that I've been to in all my life. I mean, going to new places like Simbat. When I went to Simbat, granted the people there speak French, um, but seeing the way that they enjoy the music, it's like, wow, some years ago, no, they would be accustomed to the older bands and the older people, but now they're open to the vibe and the energy of soca. Well, you're young and cute as ever, <laughs> but you are a veteran in this soca thing. Yeah. Do you have any advice for the newer artists coming out? Well, all I have to say is, you know, guys, take your time. You know, it doesn't happen overnight. Just like me, I mean, I started looking at people that would inspire me, wanting to be like them, and then becoming their peers and being just like them, being on stages with them, and then some of them seeing them fall behind because, you know, time passes and it happens. But take your time because you want to be in this business for a long time and you don't want to just yeah. get there and then it's like okay what next if you take the right steps to get there then you make sure that you're, you're totally grounded in what you're doing and having the experience and all of that so just take your time do it well do it to the best of your ability love it embrace it and share it well as a mother myself I know you're a mother do you have any words out there for those soca mommies out there oh, who are going to work and struggling and keeping a family together well I don't have to tell them because I'm sure they already know being a mom being a soca mom is very 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 hard for me I think I'm a little bit more crazy with it because I have to make sure that I'm a hands-on mom I'm there for everything even though I'm not there for everything you know like I would talk to my daughter on Skype I talk to her on FaceTime it's driving me crazy right now because I can't talk to her at all um, but you know you just do what you need to do when you're with your kid you focus on your kid when you're working you focus on your work but you do all of them to the best of your ability work hard love what you do and everything else will fall in place and don't forget God is the boss.
Well, we thank you so much for your time. Thank you for having we me. We really appreciate it. Keep up the great oh work. Oh my gosh, I will. Don't <laughs> stop. So Never. Say so and Destra on the Uber Soka Cruise 2016. Yeah, man.